The natural world in all its beauty harbors secrets, hidden amongst the vibrant flora and fauna danger often lurks unseen, unheard. These dangers serve as a reminder, a stark warning that we are but visitors in these wild domains. Today we're diving into the world of the most dangerous snakes in North America. Creatures both fascinating and fearsome, their potent venoms have earned them a chilling reputation. The Eastern Diamondback, the largest rattlesnake in North America, is a creature of formidable presence. Its thick, heavy body is adorned with a distinctive diamond pattern, a warning to any creature that dares to come too close. When threatened, the iconic rattle sounds, a high-pitched buzz that sends shivers down the spines of predators and humans alike. This snake's venom is a potent cocktail of hemotoxins, designed to break down blood cells. A bite from an eastern diamondback is a serious medical emergency. Despite their fearsome reputation, these snakes are not inherently aggressive. Their role in the ecosystem is vital, keeping rodent populations in check. Across the vast expanse of the American Southwest, the western diamondback reigns supreme. Responsible for most snakebite fatalities in the U.S., its venom is a complex mixture of toxins, attacking both the circulatory and nervous systems. Victims experience excruciating pain and tissue damage. It prefers to rely on its camouflage but will defend itself with lightning-fast reflexes. While the western diamondback and eastern diamondback snakes command attention with their deadly reputations, there exists another predator no less dangerous, lurking in the shadows of the American Southwest. The Mojave Rattlesnake, often mistaken for its cousin, the Western Diamondback, is one of the most venomous snakes in North America. Its venom is a potent cocktail, more toxic than that of the Western Diamondback. It contains a unique combination of neurotoxins and hemotoxins, capable of causing severe neurological symptoms and extensive tissue damage. The Mojave Rattlesnake's bite can lead to paralysis, respiratory failure, and even death if not treated promptly. This snake is a master of stealth. Preferring the cover of night, it hunts small mammals and birds relying on its excellent camouflage and keen senses. Despite its lethal potential, the Mojave rattlesnake, like many of its kind, would rather avoid confrontation, striking only when threatened or provoked. Understanding and respecting these creatures is crucial, not only for our safety, but also for appreciating the delicate balance of nature they maintain. As we delve deeper into the world of these silent hunters, we uncover the intricate dance of beauty and danger that defines their existence. This chapter discusses the beauty that masks danger in some of the most dangerous snakes. The coral snake with its vibrant bands of red, yellow, and black is a sight to behold. But this beauty masks a deadly secret, a potent neurotoxic venom. Unlike rattlesnakes, coral snakes have small fixed fangs and deliver venom through a chewing motion. Symptoms of a bite can be delayed, leading to a false sense of security. Without antivenom, paralysis and respiratory failure can occur. Fortunately, coral snakes are reclusive and rarely encountered by humans. In the murky depths of swamps and slow-moving rivers, the cottonmouth, also known as the water moccasin, makes its home. This semi-aquatic snake is known for its distinctive white mouth lining, which it displays as a warning when threatened. The cottonmouth is a member of the pit viper family, possessing heat-sensing pits on its face that allow it to hunt warm-blooded prey in near darkness. Its venom is a potent hemotoxin, similar to that of the rattlesnakes, causing severe pain, swelling, and tissue damage. Cottonmouths are often perceived as aggressive, but this is largely a misconception. They are, however, more likely to stand their ground when confronted, leading to a higher incidence of bites. The copperhead, with its distinctive hourglass-shaped markings, is a master of camouflage. Blending seamlessly into leaf litter and rocky terrain, it often goes unnoticed until it's too late. While the copperhead's venom is the least toxic of the snakes we've discussed today, it is still incredibly painful. Victims often experience intense burning, swelling, and discoloration at the bite site. In rare cases, severe reactions can occur, leading to complications. Copperheads are generally not aggressive snakes, but their cryptic nature and preference for habitats near human settlements increase the likelihood of encounters. The snakes we've explored today serve as a powerful reminder of the importance of caution and respect when venturing into the wild. While their venomous nature demands our attention, it is crucial to remember that these creatures play a vital role in maintaining the delicate balance of their ecosystems. By understanding their behavior, respecting their space, and appreciating their beauty from a safe distance, we can coexist peacefully with these fascinating and often misunderstood creatures. Stay safe and stay informed. Thanks for watching.